Thank you. Uh, hello, Mr. Borrell. Uh, last time we spoke, the EAS was being portrayed as bowing to Chinese pressure on its disinformation reporting. We found out from you that Chinese pressure had an effect on the EAS. So what concrete steps did you already take and are going to take to avoid self-censorship in the future? To follow up, Mr. Borrell, in our last hearing, you accused the junior staffer at the EAS of leaking confidential emails regarding the disinfo report. What evidence have you found to substantiate your accusations? And if there is no evidence, how have you apologized to the staffer? To talk not only about the past events, but about the most pressing ones now. How do you see the future of the investment agreement negotiations between the EU and China in light of the China Communist Party's slow coup in Hong Kong? Thank you.